So Andrew, if um, if you're trying to get it so that non-editing teachers can still grade assignments, but not view the grade book. Now, I know that doesn't quite fully meet your needs, but um, it would be a step in the right direction. I don't know that you'd get it perfectly without um, doing doing maybe two assignments, something along those lines. Uh, but what you can do, uh, if you wanted to apply this for the entire course, is you could go under Users, go to Permissions, and when you're in here, okay, you'd want to filter, type in Grade, and this is going to bring up uh, the capabilities for um, anything with the word Grade. And what I'm interested in to see if this will help you here would be under course and you would want to go to where it says view grades of other users right here remove non-editing teachers so I just click the X because by default non-editing teachers can view the grades of other users and so I'm just gonna remove them and this is only for this course in other courses non-editing teachers would totally be able to view all of the uh, uh, grade books. Now, under the activity for assignment, okay, grade assignment, you want them to be able to grade it, but you may not want them to be able to view the grades. And so you can hit uh, remove that as well. And so let me see if I can change my role from teacher and I will be added in as a non-editing teacher and uh, you know what though I'm logged in as site admin so let me just uh, switch my role to non-editing teacher and let's go into let me see if I can view the grades sorry but you do not have permissions to do that okay and let's see if I can go into view grade all submissions so if there was an assignment turned in here I could actually get in here and and view or or actually give it a grade but I just can't see the grade book so I know that you want uh, the the kids to be able or the non-editing teacher to see the grade book but maybe that's just not possible um, this would at least get you one step closer uh, there's nothing here to display so um, yeah hopefully that'll get you going in the right direction again you're gonna wanna come in and go to users permissions this is where you can override the default settings instead of doing it at the the site level and creating an entirely new role you could just tweak it for the way you want it to behave inside this single course so hopefully that helps you